squad, 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 yeah. Welcome back to Young Bill Tastic. It's your boy Oscar Shahid. I'm Mohammed Ita. We're over Pizza Hut and we're over Domino's. We want something different. So where are we at? We're at Frank's Pizza in downtown. Let's check it out. Let's go. So we just got our food. I'm excited, this is a lot. Listen, I was hangry. I'm at ease right now, I'm ready to eat. So uh, let me tell you what I got. I got a couple of slices of cheese, a couple of slices of chicken pesto. It's just pesto as a sauce and chicken on top, and a hamburger. What about you? I got three slices of cheese. One of them, I put mushrooms and jalapenos on. I ordered a spinach pesto, and one, it was supposed to be this chicken special, but they mixed up my order with his, I guess. Yeah. And they got me a chicken pesto too. You can't go wrong with a chicken pesto. So let's start with the cheese pizza. This looks so good. All right. It's greasy, but it's that good grease. I'm not mad at the grease at all. It's so good. It's by far one of my favorite pizzas ever. You haven't tried the other ones yet. You might have to dab it just a little bit. But I love the crust. It's fluffy. It's crispy. Right, it's not too crusty, not too crispy, not too... It's perfect. I'm gonna do an upgrade. Cheese pizza with jalapeno and mushroom. All right, and I have the hamburger right here. I'm in heaven, man. Ah, is this what heaven tastes like? It's just a step up from that cheese. Um, you have that savoriness from that beef, but you know nothing, not, nothing too different from that cheese pizza. You know, if you need some protein or you need something a little extra, hamburgers the way to do it. Literally elevated the cheese pizza experience that I had earlier. The jalapenos are like on point with the spiciness. It's just amazing. Picks up, up the flavor. I love it. Yeah. Favorite pizza by far. I think this needs a little bit of spice. Uh, you know, I think I would have been happy with a little bit of jalapenos. I need some jalapenos. I need some brininess. Let's move on to the chicken pesto. <laughs> This is where it's at. I don't know. I the chicken's not on my favorite. Chicken's really weird. dry. Yeah, it's super weird. dry. But the pesto sauce, great. I love it. I feel like if you're looking for something other than a marinara sauce, uh, mm -hmm. you know, I think they have a really good pesto. But the chicken is really dry. You know how pesto can be a little overpowering with like so much garlic and basil. This is just subtle, but it's good. You can taste it, but it's good. It's not like. Ah. Yeah, I think this is my favorite so far. Yeah. Let me try the spinach one. It's the same thing, but spinach inside of chicken. Yeah, it's a great vegetarian option. I feel like this is gonna be better because I didn't really like the chicken too much. So I feel like this is gonna be better than that. It's better than that one. I love spinach. Pesto's on point. Do you know what these pizzas need? A nice complimentary ranch. Ranch. Uh, I think the ranch really elevates this pizza. It gives it a different depth of flavor. All right, awesome. What do you think of the ambiance? I, I think the ambiance is great. Uh, I'd give it a 10 out of 10. Let me tell you why. I feel like I'm in a pizza shop in New York, and I feel like, well, I know this, this place is popping on the weekends, late nights. This place is open late nights. How do you here. know that? I know that because, you know, I hear things. The only issue is the food takes a while. And that's because, you know, if you order something uh, customizable and special, it'll take a while. Other than that, man, it's cool. I'll give it a 10 out of 10 as well. Yes. I love this place. Uh, it reminds me of like a little mom and pop shop in uh, Manhattan, New York City. Uh, easily you can just pick it up and drop it in New York and you wouldn't feel out of place. 
Um, the, the wait time is not an issue at all. It's actually worth it. It doesn't take that long. We just ordered like a billion different slices, so that's why it took that long. We're here on a Monday night, but once you come here, just expect on the weekends to wait maybe 20 minutes, maybe a little longer, you know? But uh, it's worth the wait. Asa, man, what do you think about the food, man? Okay. What do you think about the food? The food, I'll give it a 9.8. Mm -hmm. That's the highest I've given anything yes. so far. But I really like these pizzas. They really give me these, that New York vibe. Um, the only thing that's stopping me from a 10 is that it's just, they came out fresh, but it wasn't hot enough. You want it like, piping hot? Yes, that's how you get it in New York. So man. what? I don't want my pizza hot. You have to wait for it to like, like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle pizza just yes. dripping. Yes. I don't want that. No, I think like, I want to feel perfect. like I'm in the sewage wearing like a mask and stuff. You know what I mean? No, I don't want the roof of my mouth burning. So you know, I'm content with this. I'd give it a ten. Oh wow. Yeah, okay. it's a ten. Yeah. I think it's the best pizza I've had so far in my life. Yeah, I love it. In my life, I've been to New York. Nothing compares to my guy Frank's pizza right here. All right, Allison. Is the food worth the price? Definitely. 10 out of 10. Wow. It's worth the price. Wow, man. What is that? Is that a trifecta of, of 10s? Is this a perfect score? I think so. Yeah. I don't I, think that's ever happened so far. This hasn't happened yet, but yeah, I think it's a, a decent price. I don't think it's overpriced. I think for what it is, especially these slices are large, man. I think it's it's dope stuff. It's dope pizza. I don't recommend it to anybody. Alright, I'll give the pricing a 9.8 as well. Um, the only reason is because, again, like I said, I've been comparing it to every like shop in New York. And every shop in New York, you could find it for cheaper, like one or two dollars. But maybe that's because there's so much so many of them. I don't know. But I mean, it's worth it. Yeah. So 9.8 is really up there, like, you know? Yeah, hey, where's it? Frank, I'll send you my personal number, man, so I can just thank you for, for this creation here in Houston. I think this is a landmark. This is something special, you know? It. Yeah. This is really I don't something disagree special. disagree with that statement. For sure. And uh, overall, man, it's cool stuff. I'll give it, like, put, put your thumbs up. And then, hey, hey, you, come here, give me your thumb. This is six thumbs up right here, man. Six thumbs up, I appreciate it. Man, that was some good food. It's probably the best pizza I've had. If you want more information on this place, check the description down below, and don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that bell icon for notifications on every new video we drop. If you want to recommend a restaurant, slide into our DMs at yumdoptastic to let us know what you want us to review next. And don't forget to check out our last video over here and our playlist over here. It's your boy, Awesome Shad. I'm Muhammad Isa. And you're watching. Yum Dope Task. And we're out. Woo! Mm. Yes. Way too good.